Hola. Hola, chiquititos. <laughs> so today we're going to talk about emotional release. <laughs> Not that kind of emotional no. release. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> yeah, so basically, uh, in a lot of the work that we do with people and that we do with ourselves and what uh, we practice a lot <laughs> uh, is how you go through this emotional bo body, you know, like all the things that we carry and maybe we never express, the tears that we never cried, the frustration that we never put out there. Uh, and we facilitate people to do it in a very kind and gentle Soft. way. Uh, and at this moment, in a way that you can create a bit more distance from this emotional body in reality, because it doesn't exist if you don't feed it. And in reality, the problem is that at times we feed it way too much. Basically, we identify too much with our emotions, yeah? <clears throat> and um, there are various tools that we can use. Um, we're always thinking about tools. It's like, sometimes I feel like I have a tool shop, <laughs> which I don't. <laughs> anyway, joking apart. Um, <clears throat> in, our, in, in our practices and, and how we deal and work with, with people, there's the, the yoga, sound, the, the rapé, the heart connection and communication. Mm -hmm. Those are main, the, the main things that we use. Um, uh, and then again, the whole the whole idea is to energy emotion, yeah, emotions. I mean, I'm sure that we, you've heard this over and over again. Emotions are just energy emotion, and when you say emotional release, it's simply there is some energy that should be emotion, and at the moment is not emotion. So what we do is simply allow it to help move. you exactly help you to disidentify with it so it can start moving again and if there is something to see and feel in in that space then you you allow exactly yeah. that you allow whatever needs to come up can come, up. come up and uh, yeah and we just hold space for that basically and yeah. of course facilitate that process for someone that might not have the ways or the tools to how to deal with their emotions um, a lot of people suffocate them and they don't you know, maybe they go through intense life experience, traumas, and they never had the space or someone that could just help them to cry, to, you know, to be fully present with whatever is there for them to feel. So that's with us and through the things that we offer, you will have the opportunity to do that. Always in safety, kindness. And love. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.